Only had it one way to the top. I ain't dressing no hope at the spot. I came a long way, you know when I finished. New baguettes, they busting out the watch. Yeah, I'm in the city. Just hit sex, pick the cop the Water dripping up a chain like a fatty. And I ain't wasting no time. Gotta So guys, it definitely looks sunny, well it is sunny, it looks warm but it is freezing, it's 2 degrees uh, right now, so I'm wrapped up. Also, this is the first time me using the iPhone 11, so I finally got it, we're going to see how it goes, this kind of, I really want it to go well because I want this to be my new vlogging one, uh, so hopefully it does. And I'm still using the back of the camera so I can't even see myself right now, so I can't even tell if I'm too close, but I'm hoping the camera goes well because this is gonna make vlogging and you know talking to you guys so much easier so yeah anyway what i've got in store today is i have to go back to cos because i've got to return a pair of pants do you guys remember the pants that i got from um obviously that i got from cos but they were in my seven outfit seven days new york edition those awesome kind of like wide leg high-waisted gray pants i haven't worn them since and that's also the reason why they weren't in my 10 favorite pants is because there was actually a default with like all of the pants where they got this weird like wrinkle stuff um and the lining on the inside just got completely ruined so I'm returning those i think i'm gonna exchange them for a sick knit so let's jump to cause and see see how it goes eh? So guys, this is literally what I was talking about um, with kind of just the whole lining and stuff on the inside. Um, so it's taken me quite some time to bring them back, but the bro is helping us out heaps, the plug. Yeah. So we're gonna sort that out and then look at getting a different sweatshirt. So I've actually just stumbled upon this cardigan. Now I'm wearing an XL. I think I actually do need to go down to a large, but it is one of the softest oh, like wool cardigans ever in an awesome gray. That's what it looks like. Let me know what you guys think. Cause I, I think this is just amazing and so cozy, like seriously. So this is actually the large that I've just put on. And I think that actually is a better fit. So that's kind of cheer. I really like it. Super, super soft. Just so nice. Really nice gray. Thick as well. I think it's like 60% wool. Let me know what you guys think. This is that thick turtleneck. The one that I've always got, already got in gray. So this is what I was looking at getting because I returned the pants or so exchanging. Um, this one is in the large. Again, let me know what you think. We just came to Arket as well really quickly. And these are the boots that I've been trying on. Now I'm really impressed with Arket, like kind of doing these, like coming out of their kind of, I guess comfort zone and just pushing the limits a little bit. Definitely a bit more chunkier in this kind of like khaki green. That's what it looks like with the full fit. Yeah, again, let me know what you guys think of them. I, I think they're definitely really sick, um, but I'll take them off and show you them properly. Like I said, definitely that chunkier sole. Um, you've seen like Prada and stuff do a lot of this on the runway. 175 pounds, so still the price tag is up there, but it is that premium leather as well. So if you're wanting something a little bit extra without spending the price tag of Prada, or I think it's Alix and stuff like that, have a look at these. We got the bow to try on the black pair. What do you think of them, man? Okay. That's something I've normally tried on, but they are They're That's comfortable sick. as well. Yeah. That's what I mean, like like I said, even the black is like different, but still low key. And just that chunky sole. Look calm, man. So huge shout out to the bow. Always helps me out um, at COS. Uh, so we were able to exchange those pants 
and just exchange them for this. So I don't have to spend any more money. I don't want you guys thinking I'm just out here just spending money. I just switch them in and out. Uh, the boots from Arkit, again, are sick. I love them. Uh, the bow might pick them up. But again, for me, I don't need them. But if any of you guys are looking at getting some boots that are slightly different, I definitely recommend you to check them out. Anyway, I switched into this because I absolutely love it. I got mine in a size of large. My gray one uh, is actually in an extra large. So, which fits still great. Big, comfy, oversized. This one's just a little different. I said I got the phone to make it <laughs> easier to vlog, but I fully have just not vlogged today. And now as you see, it is nighttime. Let's see how this front camera holds up. Um, done shooting with Jimmy, didn't show you that, which I was meant to. Now I'm on the way to the gym. Um, also, what I did just get as well, which I didn't tell you, so it is just being uh, pierced because that's where I'm gonna put in the BK, the bare knuckles earring. But unfortunately, I have to wait four weeks. Um, so yeah, but that's a nice little update. It is <laughs> it's 4 p.m. This is how dark it is in London at 4 p.m. This vlog is actually going terrible because we just shot and I wanted to show you everything I'm with Paul. Um, so we were just in a studio shooting and it's annoying because I really wanted to show you the footage of it, like for the video and just some behind the scenes, but I didn't. But we actually come to shoot some photos now. We're gonna use this wall here, like a long shot. We are just walking through. So I'm gonna get changed in the middle of the street. It's about four degrees. Um, so hopefully you guys like the photo. I also just had a triple shot monster thingy, which was terrible. Um, yeah, so it's gonna be, yeah, let's get to it. Photo time. This is where we're gonna change. This is changing room for today. Nice and private. So when you guys see a photo go up, there's a little bit of behind the scenes shit that you don't see. The little trick I started doing is I wear my gym <laughs> little like compressions so I'm not as naked. And then you just gotta embrace it. <laughs> The other hard bit is when you find a cool spot, it's normally a spot where a lot of people are walking through. So, but this is the foot. I like it. That is my part done. I'm back in my clothes because I was so cold. It's Paul's turn now. What, Bo, what advice do you give? Because we've got a lot of people watching us. Yeah. Yeah. What <laughs> advice do you give to like people who are like you? Like, like um, people looking and. Come out in your outfits. You don't have to change in the streets. It's not by force. <laughs> but what about when we're taking photos and a lot, a lot of people are watching? Don't give a fuck, bro. Look, just turn around. Look how many people are in the street. Okay, was <laughs> this was the quietest time now? There was, a, there was a lot more than four. Yeah, so bro. we're in a bit where people are like constantly walking past, and you've got to just enjoy it. Like again, most of the time, it's just because it's different. Like they're not actually like laughing at you. Yeah, you just got to pretend they're not there. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna shoot Paul's bit and then go to the gym because it's so cold. We're gonna do a quick leg session. Uh, then we've got events to go to later. So today's leg workout is um, just explosive, not really much weights, plyometrics type shit, just a fun one. In and out. Hopefully within an hour. Let's go. I got prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims I saw but my run through the money the press will be calling left on my blessings I feel like I'm falling the birdie is back tell me I'm garbage I'm going through something that's why I ain't calling phone and progression is all that I wanted the phone and affection I summon and dub it cause bitch I got prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims I saw but my run through the money the press will be calling left on my blessings I feel like I'm falling the birdie is back tell me I'm garbage I'm going through something that's why I ain't calling phone and progression is all that I wanted the phone and affection I summon and dub it why you be all in my line about nothing, why won't you go get you a dollar or something? Don't hang with a nigga who lying for nothing. I see that we different, you riding, I double. I don't do discussions on bragging about hundreds. Don't go 
go to your places, I know that they sunken Don't call me your brother, I barely can trust it I talk to a shorty, she bagging the bugging And I'ma need all of my dollars on corporate So hand me the money, I divvy the pie I'ma give all of my people a portion To build them a fortune, I'm flipping the ride I can't be mixy when iffy the vibe And 40 on 50 is really the time Why is you all on my phone like you want me? Like you wasn't pushing the kids to the side I don't know if you bitches are thinking I'm blind Cross on my crosses and dot on my eyes Done with your efforts, I'm dealing with pressures I know it's a lesson, that's word of the wise Dubbing the mixes I'm mixing, I know I've been missing I needed some personal time Fuck all the pictures, dimensions I don't with your digits I mean it, I'm staying inside Cause bitch, bitch I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them, I run through the money The pressure be calling Left all my blessings, I feel like I'm falling The birdie is back Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something So that is the workout done Done and dusted We're literally <laughs> We're literally like going home for an hour and then we're gonna link back up so you'll see us together in a sec because we're going to a little event thing tonight so i will promise to show you guys dressing dressing up a eh? trying trying paul's channel's coming soon as well so keep an eye out the next shot you'll see we're gonna be all dressed up and we'll be at the event so fast forward to then let's go to go into the event breakdown shoes boom 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 for I don't want to be on this one because it wasn't open <laughs> actually let's see boom boom I have an 8 an 8 plus, so <laughs> don't worry you're gonna get the 12 but if I had a 7 before that look who we ran into Mr. Tim himself <laughs> and bring here on camera Sarah with shops out and obviously we know we've got Paul here we're just here with shop taking a little bit of champagne uh, just going in with it um, yeah a bit of like socializing and stuff like that so just try Paul and I always are just like real funny do you know what's funny I didn't know Tim was coming I actually didn't know Tim was coming I walked in he was the first person I saw but it's weird you didn't tell me then you didn't tell me you were coming yeah, but <laughs> I didn't even know it. but yeah so we're gonna enjoy it and maybe chat to you guys in a little bit I look short on the camera next to you I look fast <laughs> Uh, so that was a good night um i ended up getting home at about 12 which was no it was even 11 30 that's a lie got home at 11 30 but because i normally always go to bed around like 10 10 30 and then always roughly get up at about between like five and six it makes you just feel so much worse when you don't get like your adequate amount of sleep so today is feeling some type of just Obviously, we had a little bit to drink as well, but that's not really it. It's just tired. Like, it's just one of those days where you're like, it's going to be a long day. No, that was pretty fun um, with ShopStyle, like, hosting us and stuff. And, like, all the other brands that were there. So, it's like, ShopStyle is the, like, the affiliate links that I use. So, when I link you guys, like, a product, I use their affiliate links. So, obviously, if you guys click through or decide to purchase something, um, I get, like, the tiniest <laughs> uh, commission uh to it it's like no added anything to you guys it's just yeah for the links and stuff like that uh but it was really cool to have like them invite you down i like it when brands actually reach out and stuff a bit more and actually care to invite you down to like their christmas things and stuff you know obviously there were other brands that they work with so it was like there was like harvey nichols there was like mr porter there uh weekday all that type of stuff oh do you, do you know what i, I should have shown this so i've been to like a few events and stuff um this one had the best food so normally they have all these like little foods yeah like all that like fancy like, people food <laughs> that's what i call it paul and i went to one last time and food was dead like they were trying to be too fancy i was like oh i'm not like, my palate is not um my palate's not ready for this like i'm not that fancy with my food so my palate was like what but last night first off they had these chicken burger things again like real small but so good um then they came around with this amazing beef wellington again real small but so good um oh there was an avocado on like a tortilla chip it was sick uh mini mince pies uh 
halloumi with like i think it was like an orange or something on top and it was sick food was sick um i love like miniature food that tastes hella good but you don't feel as bad when you like munch it all down like i had many i think i had like three or four of those burgers mini burgers but that probably equivalates to a whole burger plus all the other stuff um bad side is so they were serving champagne you could get your own drink and stuff like that now paul and i don't normally drink now the problem is when you go to events like that is they literally have somebody who is going to be coming around and like constantly filling up their drinks because i think what happens is they've actually got to get rid of a certain amount of alcohol um so they're always going to be trying to top you up so you just like you have a sip of your drink and you're there and someone's just like filling it up and you're like oh, oh okay bad thing about it is you really lose track of how much you're actually drinking so you have to be careful guys drink responsibly that was a random like right not right that was just a random little chit chat to you guys um i want to start vlogging and shit more i really want to start like fully us like people connecting more um yeah so i'm gonna get back to editing and i'll check in with you when i check in with you hope you've you know, it's all having a good day as well positive vibes being grateful just rambling now so yeah See you in a little bit, eh? Saturday morning, we're actually doing our last bit of our shoot again with Paul. This is gonna look like the same stuff with you guys, but it is nice and early. Well, I think it's like nine now. Oh, I don't know what time it is now. It's like maybe 10. But we've been here since like 8.30. Like on the weekday, this spot is so packed and stuff. But on the weekend, completely dead because it's all like the corporate like work area. Uh, so this is the vibe that we're going for. That actually looks sick down camera. Um, shooting a video for Paul and then just getting a little bit of uh, just photo content for myself. So this will bite by the gym. So we'll grab a coffee and then hit a workout, eh? Are you doing the same workout as me? What are you doing? Well, we're running first. So we'll run. Yeah. <laughs> we'll run and I was going to do push. Push can do. Okay, push. Pu push and run. <laughs> when you back? When you Free back? Workout snack. Coffee. Coffee. Seriously, guys, I can't get used to this camera. I just did this whole talk and I wasn't even filming. So I actually might go back to a vlogging camera. Uh, but what I was saying is. <laughs> what I was saying is, is like, yeah, but. Is, um. Free workout snack. An espresso. Tired. Haven't really eaten today. Uh, so we're gonna get ready for our run, get our heads right, push workout, and then the rest of the day is chill. So no tracking day. I don't track my calories, I don't do anything like that. It's just a day of enjoying it. Uh, so not sure what I'll get up to later. But yeah, just in a uh, little Starbucks. Mm. Munching on a whisper bar. So, mm. Two fathers on the butt. <laughs> have it so that's pretty much uh a little bit of a week in my life i hope you guys enjoyed it and it's a bit random honestly getting used to the phone is uh it was a little bit it wasn't as easy as i thought it would be um but i just need to keep like trying with it so yeah i hope you guys had a good week keep dressing well and i'll see you fellas next time peace